what it is what it's looking like man it's your boy trey today i got a video five clip video why the hell i'm tired of man 22 and why the hell man 23 needs to hurry up bro i don't know how much more of this game i can play man i don't know how much more of this i can do dog like this game is not made it's not made for the same bro i feel like you gotta be you gotta be clinically insane to to, to to, to function and play a full weekend league or play a thousand games of this game some gotta be wrong with you bro if you stacking up thousands of games this year man 22 if you can endure that bro something wrong with you something wrong with you but hey but hey props to you though props to you but y'all mother f was crazy dog y'all wild if you if y'all could tolerate this man Y'all all have been here. We everybody have been finessed. Everybody have been hold. Everybody have been done dirty. But this is just five clips. I had a previous video called "Why I Hate Madden." This is kind of like "Why I Hate Madden 22," but this is more of why I cannot wait to stop playing Madden 22. Why I cannot wait for Madden 23 to get here because these clips have happened in the past three days. This is within three days, y'all. So just imagine if I played way more games than I usually do. Exactly. This is in the span of three days. So clip number one is zero three, whatever, bro. I, I, I beat this dude. I remember, but I just want to pause it right here. Wide open. Calvin Johnson, 99 hands, 99 catching, whatever, 99 speed. Nobody around him. It's a touchdown, right? I don't give a hey, I don't give a fuck. If, if, if it's say inaccurate bruh inaccurate i don't give a damn look where the ball is and look what calvin is this is a catch of a ball y'all it is not what y'all think y'all might be like oh maybe he just overthrew him or no 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 no, no. it ain't an overthrow the ball actually is right on target because i use her calvin to make the play you know what i'm saying you know i click on like cool let me go hand the x let me go boy look at the goddamn ball y'all look at the goddamn ball man it's in his goddamn hands bro no he's looking at it he's looking at it like yeah bro i'm going to the goddamn touchdown boy i'm going to the crib with this one ain't nobody within 15 20 yards on me we taking this to the crib man he ain't said nah bro you ain't taking none to the crib this is how the hell we getting started man on the clip too bro so the second clip man now this clip right here you see the score 31 35 i'm currently down by four points 10 seconds left one timeout so yeah i need a touchdown obviously i need a touchdown to win the game a field goal is not gonna do it so i just want y'all to take a real close look at the setup of the defense he's running so number one either this is a cover two or it's a cover three with a dude drop down but it is it easy it looks like a cover two but like i said it could be a cover three as well because of the um see the other safety corner whatever right there lined up above y and then this guy down here to the bottom right i think he was audible down so i think it is a version of cover three i think he i think this dude was running the meta if i'm not mistaken bro either way I'm going to just show y'all what the hell happened. This is a game-winning potential touchdown, bro. Game-winning, y'all. Here we go. So wait, 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 wait. Before I pause it, look at A. At first glimpse, y'all, it's obvious, it's obvious. Who should I throw the ball to? Who should I throw the goddamn ball to, y'all? RB, probably not. We got nine seconds. I throw it to RB. You know, he may get... I don't know. He may he may get the first down. He may not. But then I'll have to call a timeout and go for another play. B, probably not. I throw that to B. It's two dudes going to him. So I throw the ball to him nine times out of ten. Either go get picked because there's a guy lurking. And there's a two guys over the top. Why? Probably not. That's a tight window. I bullet past that. 89 is probably going to jump up like a goddamn bunny rabbit and pick it off. Or they might make the safety to the left right there. Drive down and get the ball. X, obviously not. He's got damn double, co double covered because they know about Ed too damn tall Jones. And A, 
wide the hell open. You see his user, he's going down to the running back. He doesn't know where the hell to go. And A, hey, look at the open space, y'all. I just want you to look how wide open this man, Darren Waller, has. Bro, there is no physical way anybody should get to make this goddamn play, man. And I just pause it right there. Again, I'm about to I'm about to unload it. And I'm looking for the ball to be thrown to the right. Like I want to lead it to the right because you see, as soon as I get into the throwing motion, they let Mike Evans, which is the safety right here, they let him automatically react to the throw. Like, like, bro, like, look, he, I mean, he's playing, he's playing, he's kind of playing in the middle of both routes, but he's so much farther from Darren Waller. He's so much farther, farther, bro. So I throw it. He reacts. Okay, cool. Now, my, my thing is, why couldn't the ball be led farther to the right? Because it's Madden 22, goddammit. If it's Madden 23, I could have that ball thrown to the G or in the middle of the E and the G. That's where I want the ball to be. I want the ball to be as close to the G as possible. So that way, there's no way this idiot, Mike Evans, can make any type of play. Regardless, he shouldn't be able to anyway. But look. You see, the ball is thrown right on the E, which gives Mike Evans an opportunity to stop the pass. But if that ball is thrown closer to the G, bro, where I tried to lead the ball to, bro, there's no there's no chance. There's no chance. And, and, and that happens, bro. And that's my game winning touchdown, bro. And before y'all pause it, see, yeah, two things light up. I have deep end. This idiot, Darren Waller, has deep end. So you can see both of them light up. Yeah, this idiot Darren Waller has deep in. And Mike Evans has, I get, I think he had deep out on him. Deep out KO or something like that. I think it was deep out KO. So if you have deep out KO, it, it should, bruh, this is not an out route, bruh. This is an in route. In the numbers, bruh. Bruh, he shouldn't be lighting up. Why is deep out lighting up? On the goddamn middle route to start off with number one number two with deep in this should not be a drop bro especially if he was wide the hell open and i press a to possession catch he should catch the ball and drop to the goddamn flow you know what i'm saying so I, I i just don't understand what more do i have to do this is obvious this is obviously where the ball should have went and this is obviously a goddamn touchdown but the ball, number one, is not led over farther enough. Number two, deep in did not matter. And number three, deep out somehow is activating on a goddamn in route. All right, EA, cool. I lost that game, but it is what it is, bro. Next clip. All right, man, clip number three. So, y'all can see 14-7, obviously. This game was played last night live on Live on stream on Twitch, y'all. This game had me going crazy. This idiot nervy jewel, bro. I'm telling you. The game was 14-0 and, and EA started getting weird. EA started getting weird, bro. They started helping the dude out, giving him some crazy stuff, keeping him in the game. Bro, hey, I, I didn't catch all the clips. I wish I caught every single clip of, of, of how EA was just keeping him in the game consistently. But unfortunately, I did not clip all of them because I was raging at another level, bro. At another goddamn level. But it's nine seconds. It's nine seconds, as you can see. Nine seconds left in a half. 14-7. I'm like, cool. Maybe I can give me a, a quick little nice touchdown. Hey, that's what I thought. And that's what should have happened. But y'all go see what the hell happened. Yeah. Oh, oh, look. Colin Justin, he got a beat deep, huh? Oh, this Tutty right here, bop, on his ass cheek, bro. On his ass cheeks, y'all. Straight on the cheeks, bro. Look at this. You're like, cool. Yeah, hey, don't worry about the outer range. I don't give a damn about no goddamn outer range, bro. Look where the ball is and look where I am. Haynes is burnt. Colin Johnson has burnt this man, Haynes. And that ball is placed right there on the S, right under the S. This is an easy last second touchdown. I could be up 21 to goddamn seven. 
I didn't catch the clip. He shouldn't have seven points. He threw the ball through my defender on an acrobat on a, on my Cam Chancellor using acrobat, and he caught the ball through Cam Chancellor's hands and went for a touchdown. That's why he has seven points. So it, su- it should be 14-0. I told my chat to keep tabs. It should be 14-0. And this right here should have made it 21-0. But instead, we look at 14-7. So I'm like, cool. Whatever, bro. Look, like, it is, bro. Whatever. Hey, this should be 21-7. Yeah, it should be. But no, look at the ball. And look, look at Colin Johnson. Look at him. Look. Why is he not turning around for the goddamn ball? Why? Why? I'm in this damn circle. The ball is in the circle. Turn around. Put your goddamn hands up, dog. What the hell are you doing, man? Dog. Why? Pop on the butt cheeks, bruh. I, dog. Bruh. Right on the ass, bruh. Right on the ass. Look, the ball. You can't even see the ball no more. Cause it's in his asshole, man. Bro, is it, bro? It's on his ass, man. I don't understand, bro. Why? What the hell is wrong with this goddamn game? What's wrong with it? I'm just sitting there at the screen. Look, that's why I ain't picked the play. I'm sitting there like, what the hell? What? What is going on, bro? Bro, I'm just as shocked as y'all, man. I'm just sitting there wondering. Why is this game so damn trash? Whatever, bro. Fourth play, man. Here we go. All right, clip number four, man. Clip number four. So, this is the same game from the previous one I just showed. Um, You see, we, we 7 to 14, man. So, I should have had a goddamn touchdown, man. I, sh- I should have had a goddamn touchdown to end out the second half, man. But it is what it is. It's a full sweaty now. Now I gotta now I gotta try to stop this man. I gotta try to stop this man and stop EA at the same time. So it's, it's really two on one at this point, man. It's two on goddamn one. So I gotta stop him and I gotta stop EA cheating me, bro. Now this play is not too too crazy, but nonetheless, it's still kind of a bad play because anything different could have happened, y'all. Look at this, look. Pop off his helmet, and of course, it goes straight to his goddamn player. So, my thing is, if it's going to do that, why couldn't the... Hold up, I just want to pause it right quick, bro. I want to get to the right point so I can pause it, bro. I want to get to the right point so I can pause it, man. My question is, if the ball's going to bounce off a dual helmet, why why did it have to go directly where his receiver, receiver could have been the only one to catch it? Look at it. Look look at the placement of where the tip pass went. It could have went to my user. And look at this idiot back here. Look at my user. Look at me look like, look, looking like a complete idiot because I'm baffled. I'm like, ooh, the ball just bounced off his him and maybe it's going to come to me. No. It's going to go directly right there in between my corner and in between my safety that's coming down. It's perfectly placed right there. William, William put him in a parry. Big fat Perry, he ain't go jump and get that goddamn ball. So it perfectly gets placed off a helmet tip directly to him. Cool, whatever, bro. Whatever, EA. Play number five, man. Clip five, last clip. All right, y'all. So fifth and final clip, man. After that stupid tip helmet pass, bro, that he conveniently caught. We in the fourth quarter now. 14-7, we in a sweaty... Cause he's down here in scoring range, bro. And I'm at the point to where I gotta get a stop. Ben don't break D. That's what I say, man. Ben don't break D. You know what I'm saying? But that's what I think, bro. Nervy Jewel, he got other he, hey, he got other things he wanna do. So I'ma just start the clip and I'ma pause it right quick. I want y'all to see who's gonna be open or who ain't gonna be open, man. So let's go ahead and get the play started. Come on, hike the goddamn ball, you idiot. So I want y'all to look right here. Oh, let's. Pu- All right, so who's open? I want y'all to look and see who's open right now, y'all. You look over there to the left. Okay, cool. That out route. If he goes and throws it to him, no problem at all. He's the most open guy. No problem with that. Up there, top left. Randy Moss, no. He's definitely not open. That's an interception. There's two people right there on him. 
right here in the middle no way i'm picking it i'm lurking that that's me and there's somebody right there to the left of him so no he should not throw that middle route over there to the right air too tall no he got him locked down he's on the flat i got him in a hard flat that should be a pick six or a drop pass right here big bad bo jackson on a goddamn wheel route the most op route in man 22 who y'all think he go throw it to? All right. He throws it to the goddamn running back on the wheel route in between three goddamn dudes. Look at um, Cam Chancellor up there doing a goddamn cha-cha slide. He's activating for no goddamn reason. I don't know why he's turning around acting like a goddamn idiot. But whatever, bro. It is what it is. Maybe I should have manned him up. Maybe I should have manned Cam Chancellor up with him. I digress. It don't really matter. I'm right here trying to lurk this goddamn pass, bro. This looks like it should be a pick. If you just look at this clip right here, you're like, ooh, this is an interception. Even, either Khalil Mack go get him, which is right on Bo Jackson's hip, or I should maybe get it. Because Cam Chancellor, he's looking like an idiot back there. He's not doing a goddamn thing. But okay, cool. Let's, let, let's finish it. Look at the ball, y'all. Look at the ball. Look at the goddamn ball, man. The ball is hitting Khalil Mack's ankle, bro. Bro, it's right on his goddamn ankle. Right on his foot, bro. Is this a touchdown? Yes. It's a goddamn touchdown, y'all. Yo, this game is, is, is ridiculous, bro. It's ridiculous. There's no way in hell this ball should ever be a completion the ball is through my dude's legs yo yeah i'm out of reach whatever ea yeah they want to say i'm out of reach cool whatever bro but the ball khalil mack is on him khalil mack nuts is in bo jackson's face bro his nuts are in bo jackson's face how the hell is this a touchdown why this is why I can't stand this game, y'all. This game has to go, bro. Whoever developed this game, they need, a, hey, they need to be fired ASAP, bro. I'm, I'm, hey, I'm sorry to, to, to put that on you, but the developers of this game, they gotta be fired, bro. They need better people to test the game. Something, something gotta be done, cause this is unacceptable, dog. This shouldn't be a touchdown ever. Not between three people. Not when a dude ball sack is in another dude's face and the ball's getting thrown through his goddamn legs. This should never be a touchdown, bro. Never. That's disgusting. And look at the coach. He like me. Oh, what the fuck? Bro, look at him. Hands up in the air. He like, bro, what the hell? Yo, I'm just, hey, I'm just like you, coach. This game trash and I done had enough of it. My brother in the back, his hands up like, what the hell just happened? Yo, what the hell going on, dawg? He in the back too, he perplexed. We all perplexed, bro. This game sucks. I'm tired of Man 22. Like the video if y'all tired of it. Like the video if y'all ready for Man 23. Because I don't know how much more of this I can take, man. I'm out of here, bro. Y'all stay blessed. Be easy, stay breezy, man.